So this is my new uh, WinGen Cyber 500 micro turbine, um, which is supposed to create up to five amps. Um, I just put it on our deck here. It's a pretty windy day, so you can see it's going pretty well. And uh, we live on a side of a hill here, so we get we get a fair amount of wind. Um, so I used a 14 gauge wire, which is what they recommended, um, and ran it um, all the way inside. You can go up to 50 feet, I believe. And um, I kind of ran out at one point, so I did do a little job here and, and uh, wired an extra piece on. So inside, I uh, had originally tried attaching it directly, uh, or the lead wires directly to my uh, open Coleman power inverter, and um, it would light up this little night light for a little bit, and then the fault light would come on. And so I gave up on that and tried to um, power up this battery, uh, which is a boat battery, but it's a really old one, so I'm guessing that's why it wouldn't um, take a charge. So we're going to get a new one. So what I did instead, just to try it out, um, was to attach it to this LED flashlight. And so I have the positive and the negative just directly in there. There's no battery inside. And so you can see when the turbine starts to spin, uh, the light comes on. And when the turbine slows down, the light goes off. So I thought that was pretty fun to be able to see exactly when the electricity is made. We'll see it, if it comes back on here in just a minute. doesn't look like it's wanting to spin right at the moment, but anyhow, the light gets very bright uh, when it does spin. Let's give it one more minute. Mom? Yeah, one more minute. <laughs> Isaiah is not quite as fascinated as I am by this. <laughs> Okay, so here goes the turbine, and there goes my LED light. And when it spins really fast, and you get the full light. So, anyhow, just wanted to show you my new little toy. Uh, it's a lot of fun, and I'm looking forward to powering a um, or charging trickle charging a. I'm going to get a new marine battery and then you can run uh, things. I believe it'll work off my inverter at that point. I'll just um, wire the battery to my inverter and then I can plug things in directly. So, Alright, thanks for watching.